Yo, yo. Subconscious Galaxy, what is going on, boys? How we doing out here in the galaxy? Hopefully you guys are chilling. Hopefully you guys had a good day today. As always, um, as promised, I'm gonna make the, uh, the old female attraction video. All right, guys? This one is gonna be about female attraction. And I want to start it off, as always, with the disclaimer and let you know that, yes, as I do make female attraction videos, I don't believe this is the entire, you know, piece of the pie of this journey. You know, there's so many guys that, I mean, there's, there's some people that have entire channels about this, entire channels about SR and females. You know, it's like, I think it's important to talk about because it, it happens, but it is not, you know, as soon as you make this the main event of the journey, that's when you basically have failed, you know, and you're basically, it's pointless, right? Because you're going to, guys, just, it's common sense, you know, think about it. You're, you're trying to attract females and you're going to link up with all these females. You're going to smash them. You're going to release, you know, you're going to lose your, your life force. You're going to lose your essence. You know, it's a, a vicious cycle. You have to get into a place where you don't care about females and you're, and you're working on yourself. You know, you're working about figuring out who you are as a person, learning how to love yourself. What's more important, getting women or loving yourself? I mean, this is, this is, seems like common sense, right? So that's my disclaimer, but we can still talk about it a little bit and, and talk about why it happens, you know, because it's definitely um, intense, right? And, and it seems like the more that you care less about this, the more it happens, you know, the more that you're not thinking about women, the more women are going to be coming your way, you know, but you guys seen my last uh, video, you know, you got to be turning them down sometimes, right? You guys heard the story. This girl asked me to stay the night over the holidays and I'm like, I'm good, right? I'm good. I'd rather hold on to my essence. I'd rather hold on to my life force, you know, go back and spend some time with my, my mother at the house, right? Because my mom, I haven't seen her in a while, so... You know, that was more important, right? And it's it's all from being on this journey, you know, and understanding like what's what's important now, you know what I mean? And not falling for the traps of these women who just want to smash, right? Women are lustful too, you know, women, a lot of women are, all they want to, you know, same thing. They've been programmed. Some, some, they even watch porn. Women even watch porn, bro. So let's get into this, man. Why the female attraction happens and um, you know what happens and what we can do about it. So guys, the number one thing, and this is why it happens, is your energy is changing, all right? Semen retention after a period of time literally raises your vibration, you know, and you become a lot more solid. And as I said in the last video, it's all about where you're putting your energy. So you are no longer putting your energy into chasing women, going out to bars, clubs, partying, you know, trying to smash, right? You're no longer doing that. So where's all that excess energy gonna go? Into other areas, it has to, right? You, you know, we have a certain amount of energy, you know, per day. I don't know the, the units or the measurement, but like that energy is gonna go elsewhere. Right. All that energy that you're using to, you know, texting and maybe you're on the dating apps or whatever you're doing, uh, all that energy is going to get put elsewhere. You know, it could be into your fitness life. It could be into reading books. It could be making more money, you know, working more. You know, it's got to go somewhere. So think about that and how the energy is going to be transferred into the other areas. So of course your stock is going to just go up, right? As as a as a man, you're 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 going to either have more money, you're going to have more knowledge, you're going to have more wisdom, you're going to have more self-love, you know, from spending time with yourself. So your vibration is going to go up, you know, and women are very intuitive, you know, so they're going to notice that. They're going to notice that you're sticking out, you know, something's different, right? Um, people can feel other people's energy especially women. Women are super into this, guys. Like, I would say even, you know, 
more so than men. You know, they're very intuitive. They can feel your energy. They know the difference between somebody who is creeping on them or someone who's just like laid back, you know, focused and doing their thing. You know, they they know that shit fast, bro. You know, I talk to a lot of different women. Um, my cousins, you know, I got a lot of female friends, even girls that I'd be, you know, chopping it up with it. They, they, they'll let you know, you know, they, they're very, uh, in tune with all this shit, you know, so they, they know who's who. And so if you come around and you're very high vibrational and you have that laid back mentality, like you don't, you don't really care, you know, you're not really noticing them, but at the same time, you're still being nice and kind, you know, but you're not like all up in their grill, you know, looking at their titties, looking at like, come on, bro. We, we don't got to do that no more, you know, like staring at their ass and just like saying weird compliments. Like, bro, if you want to compliment the women, be smooth. Don't be all weird. You know, you got to be able to like sneak it in there, you know, be smooth. Right. So it's a lot of motherfuckers that are very creepy and weird. You know what I'm saying? I see it all the time in my work and I'm just like, dude, you guys are down bad. You know what I'm saying? So another thing, we're on retention. So we're not thinking about sex. We're retaining, you know, we're not thinking about, you know, our, our brains have been desexualized and that makes a very big impact on them, you know, because women don't want pervs, dude. They don't want guys that are constantly thinking about sex. Like, that's just not it, you know? Like, maybe like, like the Jezebels do, you know? Like, the, the, the slutty type women, you know? They, they, they would like that, right? Because they're in the same boat. But they're females, you know? But they're living in their lust too, so they will like that. But I'm talking about high quality, intelligent, respectful women, right? They're not going to like that if you're all sexualized and always horny and shit you know what i'm saying that's, that's not the that's not the vibe right so we are even more so in that um area or like you know the opposite of of that you know we're chill we're not creeping we're just chilling right and they notice that they notice that man as long as you can keep a balance of you know you don't want to be too chill to like you're just ignoring them you know what i mean like you still want to just you know, pretend like they're a dude that's what i do I literally pretend like they are a homie, right? A homie with, with titties, you know what I mean? Homie with titties, long hair, you know, energetically. That's how I, how I treat them, you know? And it's, bro, that is the, that's the mustard right there. Just treat them like a friend or a sister or a family member, you know? And so that's, that's respectful. That's the respectful way to go about it. So they notice the guys that aren't thinking about sex. So... Then the last thing here um, is that you're, you're you're getting into a space where you care less about the results. You know, it's kind of the same as the last one, but you care less about, you know, if you're really on your isolation path and you're really trying to work on yourself, you're not trying to get with women, right? So you don't care about results, you know what I mean? And they like that, man. I mean, see, there's a pattern here. The women, women like guys who are, not needy they want they want like a challenge you know and they also like guys who uh have options they don't want you to be all desperate oh i love you like simp mode they do not want that they want a guy who is on his mission they're looking for somebody to mate with like literally when you get it when you break it down they're looking for someone who can mate with they're looking for someone who will protect them and they're looking for someone who will take care of their family you know, if you ever have kids, right? They're looking for someone like that. So they want somebody who is solid, focused, you know, hardworking, you know, not like like a poodle dog just constantly thinking about women or sex, right? That's not the look. So, and then guys, another reason the female attraction hits on SR is because you just look a lot better. You look healthier. Your skin is glowing. Your hair looks nice. You know, your beard excuse me, it looks nice because all that stuff fills in from all the nutrients, you know, when you retain and your skin, you know, looking soft and nice and you know, you're getting in the gym, you're getting games, you know, all that stuff, bro. All that stuff matters, you know, guys who are constantly releasing their, their skin looks like dull and gray, you know, sometimes even like greenish color around the eyes, bro. Like it's 
Some of these dudes who be wanking it like three, four, or five times a day, straight zombies, you know? So you can see it in people's skin, you know? And women notice that stuff. They notice a guy who has nice skin, right? So those are the reasons that it happens, you guys. But be careful, you know, be careful. Because um, the journey, like I said, it's not about women. It's about God. It's about finding out who you are. It's about healing. So do your best and, and, you know, use your discernment. Try to find the girl that is good for you. Don't just take any girl that starts giving you attention, you know. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, man. Female attraction, why it happens. Use it wisely. Be careful. All right, guys. Much love.